Welcome back to Craig's Eater. We're at Dong Song Xi'an in Rosemead, California. So I'm Dee. And I'm Rob. Have you had real Chinese food in Cleveland? Yeah, I've had no. all of No, you haven't. Okay. Let's go. All right. We're trying some authentic Fuzhou and Guangdong food. What is that? Pigeon soup. Whoa, what? <laughs> Seriously, you want to order that? Yeah, I want to order that. Uh, you all right. a pigeon? No. How about this one? Crocodile soup? Yeah. There's no, we can't get that. We're really, we're really going to eat crocodile. Yeah, and if you pre-order, if you had to call ahead, they'll give you the bird's nest. You can order with your eyeballs and not order too much with your, too much thinking here, you know? Just eat with your eyes. So come take a look at this thing, right? And you'd... Yeah, look at that. That's a pigeon. It's eight Chinese herbs and spices in this broth. It's very medicinal. There's a healing properties to this. That's got some heart to it. It's got some... Oh, it's hot. It's hot. Some, it's really, I didn't expect it to be that hot. Some earthy flavor. How's that like... And you can feel the bird flying through the wind. <laughs> can you use chopsticks? Yes, I can use chopsticks. Let's see what we got here. So right. here's the pigeon, right? It's good. <laughs> you didn't think you'd like pigeon, huh? It's really good. I yeah. didn't know what to expect. But I love the flavors. That's what, that's what you want. You want right? to find off the bone. And the skin is just completely melted. Crocodile is normally deep fried, so this is kind of cool to have it in a soup. Okay. So let's go uh, take your spoon. You want? Yeah, I want you to eat it. <laughs> that's you why you're here excited? on the show. Yeah, you're All here on the right. show to eat the food, so okay. you're not here on the show to like watch All me right. eat the food. Crocodile, here we come. Unbelievable. <laughs> mmm. Mmm. Okay. 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 <laughs> All right, let's try a little bit of this. So I got some meat in here and some broth. What is a good mm. comparable meat that the average person would be? I think like a chicken thigh, a chicken which is a little thigh? bit tougher. The flavor is delicious. It's, I love this meat. I love the texture. I love the, the I love the fattiness and the flavor the crocodile meat brings to the broth. Is this elephant meat or something? <laughs> what is that? Trust me, or are you just gonna? You want me to just try it blindly? Yeah, let's try it. I try don't it. even know what it is. It comes with a little sauce here, so we okay. can All right. drizzle a little bit of sauce over. All right. All right. All right. You still got some meat left on the spoon. Mm -hmm. It's good. Yeah. All right. It's just sausage. <laughs> it's just sausage? Yeah. Right. Every country does their own style of sausage. You get a little bit of the meat, a little bit of the rice, a little bit of the sauce that we poured, drizzled in there. This brings me back to like Chinese style sausage. There's a sweetness to this, which I think is delicious. Fujian and Guangdong food from Zhongshan Xi'an. So please. I couldn't spell those to save my life. You don't have to. You can just come out and point at the menu. And that's all you need to do. So come out here, point at the menu, get the ones, get the, get the pigeon, get the crocodile, and then reserve your bird's nest if you want it.